Hi there, I'm Teresa Penenery and we've made the trip out to Lakeside where we are once again at the site of the San Vicente Dam Rays and I'm really excited to be talking to project manager Kelly Rogers who's going to give us a little bit of an update on what's going on out here. Kelly? Well Teresa, things look a lot different as you can see. The entire dry side of the dam is covered up with roller compacted concrete and the good news is we're about four feet above the existing dam heights so uh, we are officially raising San Vicente Dam. That is exciting. So now that we're above the height of the existing dam, how is construction different? Well, we talked before about the complex operation of roller compacted concrete placement. This adds one more step into the contractor's activities where he's putting together formwork, fastening it to the water side or upstream side of the dam, and then placing the concrete up against it. So is he using any type of rebar or any internal structure? No, actually the beauty of this type of design is it's a concrete gravity dam. And what that means is the weight of the concrete creates the stability. So all we're really doing is using a specialized grout to attach the new dam to the existing dam so it behaves like one seamless structure. Oh, that's really neat. So I've also noticed there's a lot of work going on out here that isn't just the dam. What else is happening out here? Well, we're going to have this big expanded reservoir and the new da raised dam. We need to get that water out of here. So we are um, constructing a new outlet tower that will deliver water to the city's customers on a daily basis. We're also constructing what we call a downstream control facility, which the Water Authority will use in an event of emergency to deliver water to the entire region. So what does the future hold for the dam race? Well, we are still on target for completing roller compacted concrete placement this year. We'll begin startup and testing of all these new facilities and then just work toward completion, which is still scheduled for 2013. That is exciting. So we'll keep you updated on Channel H2O with what's going on out here at the San Vicente Dam Rays. If you have any questions, feel free to post a note to our Facebook page, send us an email, or send us a note via Twitter. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.